All right, so this says gas is sold for $1.399 per liter in Toronto, Canada. Your car needs 12.00 gallons. How much will your credit card be charged in Canadian dollars? So the question is asking for the number of dollars. So that we know that we need our answer to be in dollars. And when it gives a, some information that says gas is sold for a dollar point three nine nine, when it says per liter, that means that it costs one dollar, one point three nine nine dollars is equal to that's one liter of gasoline. So when it uses this per, when it uses that word per, that means it's giving you a conversion factor. So we're going to use this conversion factor in the problem, but we don't want to start with conversion factors. We want to start with like just one unit. So let's start with the 12.00 gallons since that's a single unit. And we'll put times a fraction. And the answer we want to get over here is in dollars. So we need to come, we need to cancel out gallons and get to something in dollars. We have this relationship that gives us dollars and liters. We have the relationship between dollars and liters, but in order to get to use this relationship, we need to be able to first convert from gallons to the unit of liters because both gallons and liters are a volume unit. Um, so we can first convert from gallons to liters. Let's use the relationship between gallons and liters should be on your conversion factor sheet. Um, gallons. Is that one gallon is equal to 3.7, whoops, 3.7, liters. So we'll use this relationship first and put gallons on the bottom and liters on top. And the numbers follow the units. So the one goes with the gallons and the 3.785 goes with the liters. So now we can cancel out the gallons and we're left with a unit of liters. But we don't want our answer in liters, we want our answer in dollars. So now we do another conversion factor. Well, let's cancel out the liters, so we'll put that on the bottom. And we want dollars, we have a relationship between dollars and liters. So let's put dollars on top. And the relationship is that $1.399 is equal to one liter. So the liters cancels out and we can multiply by our numbers on top, and divide by our numbers on bottom. So if we start with 12.00, multiply that by 3.785 and then multiply that by 1.399. We get 63.5428. So this is the number of dollars. Um, let's look and see how we need to round our answer. Um, this 1.399 has four sig figs and 12.000 also has four sig figs. So we need to round our answer to four sig figs. That would be to the four. The number to the right is a two, so it's less than five. We don't add a one. The answer would be $63.54. So to fill your tank, your credit card would be, would be charged 63.54 Canadian dollars. So I hope this was helpful for you. If it was, please subscribe to my channel for more homework help solutions.